Hello Zebra Herd, welcome to Zebra's Arcade, a series where I try a new game every episode. Today, we're trying Bug Fables, The Everlasting Sapling. This is a really cute Paper Mario inspired game that just came out on the Nintendo Switch. It's been out a couple months on some other consoles, but so thank you so much to the uh, developers for sending me a code of the game to check it out. And this one looks really cute, so I definitely wanna try it out for you guys today. Um, if you don't know, we're very excited for some of the upcoming Paper Mario action. There's Paper Mario and the Origami King, so this is just right up the alley of that kind of game and we already played color splash and might play more paper mario games soon but anyways let's go ahead and get started with bug fables the everlasting sapling ah the land of bulgaria a peaceful prosperous place where many adventurous bugs gather although it wasn't always that way i like the little storybook openings to games like these lured by the promise of riches and lush fields a young queen visited these lands many moons ago Together with her daughters and fellow ant servants, she established Bulgaria's modest first settlement. Her people were happy, the ant kingdom flourished, and yet the queen's dream had still not been fulfilled. For she had heard of an ancient people who safeguarded a treasure of unbelievable power. It was none other than the everlasting sapling, a plant which would grant unending youth and strength to any who ate even one of its leaves. She searched and searched and searched, and alas, she never found it. She entrusted her dream to the princess before falling into a hard-earned sleep. Determined to succeed where her mother did not, the new queen rallied her, the people together under her cause. Opening the doors of the kingdom to bugs of all shapes and kinds, she attracted ambitious and skilled adventurers. Her decree was loud and clear. Find me the everlasting sapling and you shall know wealth like no other bug ever has. With this, the Explorers Associ Association was founded with its many members searching across the kingdom for clues and treasure. Even though to this day, the sapling has not been found, but every bug dreams of one day claiming it for themselves. Oh, that's cool. So it's just sort of like this almost folklore treasure, but I guess everybody believes it's real. I mean, it might be. Or at least, those were the stories I was told in my land. Despite many unfortunate incidents, tales of your people helped me keep my adventuring spirit alive. Rest assured, Kabu, they are not mere legends, but real history. This Explorers Association and all the explorers who risk their wings uh, for glory are proof of that. Then, Sir Maki, would you consider my earlier offer? Kabu, I respect your passion, but I take missions of the highest danger. An unproven warrior is not fit to occupy accompany my team. Unproven? Maki, I've fasted many hardships in the north. Or so you say. Your knowledge of our culture and your passion for exploring are as true as my blade's edge, Kabu. But I would ask you to not press the issue. This is not the place to cause a scene. Uh. What? Care, care to say that again? As I said, we cannot allow children to explore, much less snake mouth den. I am not a kid! So much for that. Would you accompany me, Kabu? It is my duty to investigate. <laughs> well, if you insist. I like her big sword. Use up, down, left, and right to move around. Press A to jump to, or to talk to people. Oh, so I play as this guy. Okay, cool. Um. Edel, B, lower your voices. What is the matter? This guy's calling me a kid. Says I can't explore. Shouting isn't going to change the rules, you child. Shut it. It's not about age. It's about skill. I'm V, the best explorer the hive has ever seen. I'm not some random bee. An explorer bee? Yeah, got a problem saying bees can't explore? Expected honey and paint? I didn't say that, but... Silence, please. This guild of ours is no place for petty squabbles. Look, I can't just give a permit to some bee, much less without a partner. Team should be a duo of explorers, you know? I'm worth, like, four bees, okay? <laughs> She's cute at the least. Hey, V. What do you want? Why don't we join forces? We both wish for a permit, yet lack a companion. What, do I look that desperate? I don't even know you. I have a promise I must keep, and for that I must explore. How bad could it be? Well, it can't be worse than having to stay put. Deal. Wait, you two are just crazy. You won't last a second at Snake Mouth. I'll prove you wrong. No. You are both, most likely, mere novices, ruled by your, by your strong emotions. I have no doubt that if you left today, you would return inside a bag. Sir Maki, although you outrank me in spades, you shouldn't underestimate me. I went through quite a bit to get here. Yeah, bugs like you that look down on others are really annoying. Hmm, 
Very well, I shall test your resolve. Test us, huh? Who named you king of this joint? Whoa, the Ant Queen herself, for she has knighted me as her royal blade. Not again. I accept your challenge. V, get ready. Who watch your horn? I was born ready. Oh, look at this, we're going into a little battle. V, our opponent is no amateur. Would you like to review some combat tips? Sure, so I don't know who our main character is out of the two, maybe it's sort of both of them. Hit me up, maybe I'll learn something. Listen then, we can perform one action per round, be it attacking, using an item, etc. We can power up our attacks by performing commands unique to each move. Watch this. If I hold down long enough, I can power up my horn strike. So he's gonna hold it down. So I gotta hold it down too, okay. Yeah, that's cool. So it's all about timing, it's just like Paper Mario. Holding a button, lame, look at this. If I press A at the right time, I can power up my beamerang. A, a beamerang? Whoa, <laughs> all right, that was good. See, we're doing great. Don't want your guard down, V. After our turn ends, the enemy's next. Oh my. I know, if I press A at the right time, ow, okay, well I didn't really do that. Pressing A a bit before the enemy uh, hits you reduces damage received. With perfect timing, we'll reduce even more damage. Uh, ow, what the heck? You trying to kill us or something? Hm. If you can't handle that much, you just surrender. Go home and guard Honey with your silly toy. Toy? Ah, now I'm mad. We should pay him back tenfold. It's time to use a skill. They're just like attacks, but you select them from the yellow flower. Skills require us to use TP, teamwork points, though, so watch out for how many we have left. We should patch your wounds too, using items from the blue flower. Toggle between commands using left and right. Okay, so we have attack here. Um, this is the blue flower, so we can heal ourselves with the crunchy leaf. A dry leaf has a satisfying crunch one bit, restores four HP to an ally. Okay, well there we go. And uh, we have skills here, taunt. Taunts enemies, making them focus on attacking Kabu for this turn. See, yeah, that's our options right now. Let's go ahead and try that. Yep. <laughs> He's like, come at me. I didn't like that very much, did they? Oh, we don't have very much HP, we gotta be careful. So let's go ahead and use our attack. Oh, three damage, not bad. And we'll just have you attack as well. Oh yeah. Oh, it could've been better, could've been better. <laughs> I forgot what I was supposed to do. Oh, I didn't time that better either. Oh no, what's happening now? S such skill with the blade. You pass. Oh really? What? You performed well enough. I can feel your desire to see the world through your attacks. I am no one to keep you from Explorer Permit. Uh, Edel, you may grant it to them. I could get no say in this, huh? But Maki is the Queen's Blade. Here, you can have it. You got the Explorer Permit. I did it, Snake Mouth Den is going to be all mine. All the riches, all the glory. I didn't see what he said though. Uh, Snake Mouth Den, it lies to the west of the association. A simple path, although filled with danger. There is much treasure to be found, but its jaws have claimed many. Treasure, huh? Maki! Who's this? Oh, seriously, brother? How long are you gonna keep me waiting? My apologies, Kina. V, Kabu, I must be going now. As you can see, duty calls me. May you succeed in your mission. All right, see ya. What a weird bunch. He ended up causing quite the scene himself. The fighting prowess, how many years ha must ha he have trained? So, uh, I'm V, I guess, from the hive near the big tree. Oh, I'm Kabu. I moved in just one moon ago from the north. Cool. Indeed. Um, Sir Maki said Snake Mouth was to the west, right? Should we get moving? Right, yeah, let's go right away. Don't fall behind, okay? Hey, what you two? Something wrong? You you know what the goal of the Stink Mouth Expedition is, right? Nope. <laughs> what? You'd go there without even knowing anything? It's like asking to perish. Shush, Edel, just say it. Your goal is to find an ancient artifact that is fabled to be inside Stink Mouth Den. How many, many tried, but no one ever found it. Most never came back. I don't know what the queen wants with that, but she is very determined to find it. We will find it, don't worry. Yeah, I'm on the case, after all. I love V's confidence. Uh. This is what worries me. Okay then, so I guess we're off. Chapter one! A dysfunctional trio. Well, that's fancy. So, let's get going. Uh, change the party leader by pressing X. You can check your inventory, stats, and other things by pressing plus. So I wonder if, if we change our leader, we'll change like the conversation. Heh, <laughs> couldn't stop me from exploring, could you? You can be as sassy at me if you want, but I was just worrying about you. Give him some credit, V. Exploring isn't a game. Many have lost while have been lost while searching for treasure. 
I know that, but we're not going to be one of those. Even Mackie thinks we're decent. I hope his intuition is right. As do I. Let's not be careless, V. We'll make it back, don't worry. See, let me try switching. Okay, it's the same thing. Just had to make sure. Um, but anyways, let's take a look at this. Oh, I can't. All right. But yeah, you can see it, it definitely has like the paper set of characters like are thin, they're 2D, and you can just flip around like that. Hi. Oh, Eri, why must Maki be so dreamy? Have you gone mad, Jen? He's, he's arrogant. You tell her, Eri. Pompous as he was, he was at least kind enough to test us. Oh no, he does that to everyone. You see this once a week. Oh, Maki, such a show off. Ah, that stupid role-playing wannabe gatekeeper, I'll show him. This will not stand. I shall challenge him to a duel of, to the death, our honor on the line. Hey, hey, you don't have to go that far. Oh, um, he's just kidding, <laughs> right, Kabu? Uh, yes, of course, kidding. I was most certainly only jesting. You better have been. Let's go, Kabu. I'll start to you. Stay out of trouble. And far away from Maki. <laughs> I guess she's very territorial over him. So what's going on up, up this way? Hello. Hmm, good showing. Not many stand Maki's blade. Why, thank you. I assume you've endured it as well. Anyone who belongs to this association can say at least that much. Wow, so everyone is, is here is crazy strong? Or they found a reliable partner to carry them. What, you're trying to say something? Not at all. If you're offended by it, it only shows your insecurity. What's your deal? You wanna fight? Enough, V, we just got granted our permit. Let's not get into trouble. Er, fine. <laughs> Good luck, you two. You'll need it. Alrighty then, I'll talk to you as well. Phew, finally done. Something work, work, sometimes work just doesn't stop coming. Uh, okay, who are you again? Excuse ya, I'm Artis and I keep this place running. Oh, thank you for all your hard work. Uh, yeah, thanks. So you two face Maki, eh? But you found it a tad too easy? You know it. <laughs> I see you like a lot like a challenge. One sec, I have this one thing. Please, take it. Uh, you got the hard mode medal. Boost enemy strength, but gives you more experience and rewards. I don't think I'll be using that, but good to know. How you got a medal. These artifacts help you by giving different effects. To equip medals, go into the pause menu by pressing plus and select medals and stats. Once there, you can equip medals to different party members using left and right uh, to switch who you are equipping it to. Medals cost MP to equip. Uh, be sure to check how much you have left. What is this, a medal? Let's say it should make things more interesting for you. The higher the risk, the higher the reward, as they say. If you defeat any powerful enemies while wearing it, come see me, all right? I won't say no to free stuff, you've got a deal. Thank you for entrusting us with it. Take care, artists. Save exploring, folks. Remember to check in every now and then. Okay, so that seems to be everybody in this room, so we're good to head out. Oh wow, it's so fancy, I love it. Uh, Anything over this way before we get started looking around? I guess not. Plenty of bugs around to talk to though, hi. Oh, is it noon? Hey, why are you hitting that crystal? You could break it, you know. Huh, you really don't know? Just tell us why. Forgive my partner, Celia. Her mouth, is, her mouth is most loose. This is an ancient crystal, correct? They're quite unique to this land. Correct, they can store the record of previous travelers if you smack them with something. This crystal is yellow, so it will even heal your wounds. You expect me to believe that? All that awesome stuff for hitting a rock? You are one of little faith. Come on, Levi, show him. Would you like to save? Yeah, sure. All right, then, so we've saved. Save complete. It is done. Whoa, it really works. This must sell for a fortune. All you get for this crystal is prison time. Only the Ant Queen can authorize placing these rocks in public spaces. Even if you find one in the wild, they are too heavy to be carried by a single bug. There goes that idea. Still, their properties are amazing. Let's use them all when we can, V. Yeah, sure, let's get a move on. Best of luck, best of luck. Okay, thank you. Um, so yeah, what else is going on around here? Because we could go that way, but well, let's talk to everybody around. Hello. Last night's rain was really heavy. We are very busy clearing up the paths. Sorry for the inconvenience. It's fine. So there's a lot of ant workers. Heave ho, heave ho! Hi. I should have gone into the city earlier. Now I have to wait until this mess is cleared. I underestimate my wife is, I uh, understand my wife is upset, but there's nothing we can do until the rocks are cleared. Ah, these rocks are getting in the way of our trade routes. If this isn't cleared soon, we'll lose money. Get on with it, Anne. This should never even happen. I mean, they're doing their best. Oh, I like the snail though. <laughs> is that a tomato can? I love it. You know, everything's just sort of shrunken down in that way. What is this about? This a little bench, I guess. So we can't go this way at all. That's fine. 
Uh, well, did we ever talk to... Yeah, that Ann over there we did. He's just sort of walking the perimeter. So instead, we'll go down this way. North Ant Kingdom, West Stinkmouth Way, and South is Golden Path. Okie doke. Oh, there's another little ant. This guy looks like more of like a soldier. The path ahead leads to Stinkmouth Den. Currently, only licensed exploration teams can pass. Do you have a permit? Yep. We have an explorer permit. Permit that shows that you are a certified exploration team under the Ant Kingdom. Hmm. All right, this checks out. I'll open the gate. Safe travels, explorers. So we can go through there now. Which we'll do in just a moment. I just wanted to see if there's anywhere else to go or people to talk to. Not quite that way. But it really does look a lot like Paper Mario 64 or the Thousand Year Door, just with the details and everything. It's really charming. Okay, oh, this is a little enemy. Oh, okay, I can't attack with anything. Maybe I should have tried jumping on him. All right then, so I don't know what this enemy is. Will it tell me? Oh, whoops, I didn't mean to do that. So again, use this stuff. Oh, strategies, here we go. Switch order, spy, do nothing, or flee. We want to spy. Tries to get information on the enemies. Yep, right there. Oh wait, do we not get the information then? Oh no. So I gotta do that right every time. Okay, spy again. Oh, that's tough. The last one is a little, okay, let's try it one more time. I'll get better at this. Hmm, it seems this land has seedlings as well. So that's a seedling, HP is four, defense is zero, scene one, this is the first one. Despite their adorable looks, they plague many fields and have no qualms devouring crops. Although the weak and puny in comparison to me, their flying variation is troublesome, as I can't reach it. I'll have to ask V for some help. Anyways, uh, okay. Well, I blocked it. That's good. Uh, let's go for you again. Ah, man, I am not good at that. Well, was that enough to take you out? Indeed it was. All right, so we get six little expiration points. We need 100 to level up. Okay, cool. Oh, wait, they dropped something. I don't know what that is. It's like a little berry. Oh, so here's the flying variation. Yeah, like I can't attack them in any way. Like I know in Paper Mario you can swing the hammer. Um, So we'll have V attack first and foremost since she's the only one who can land damage anyways. Oh, and now they're on the ground. I don't know if uh, looking at them now would really help. Yeah, because it already says seedling. Okay. Let's go ahead and do this then. Yeah, there we go, we got you in one round. That was pretty good. So, what's going on now we can get these berries? So what's this about? Uh, hey, like attacking up close, annoyed when an enemy is out of reach? Ask a friend who can fly or toss something at it to bring it down. Press X to switch positions and in battle and attack. So obviously we would have beaten the lead with this. Or maybe we could do this so that we can identify this flying seedling. Because I'm sure we're gonna wanna identify every opponent we can. Um, so spy, okay, so it's still seedling now. Um, so we can just switch order for now and just attack. Ah, oh, darn. Okay, that's enough to knock you down though. Uh, and then we can just finish you off maybe. Yeah. See ya. Okay, well there's another one done. So with that figured out, I'll switch back over. And I guess, yeah, we'll go for another seedling here. Can I hop on top of him? I can't, at least not from that angle. Oh, there's two of them this time. That might be a bit tough. But in the meantime, we might as well just go ahead and get rid of this guy. Gotcha. Okay, I blocked it. See, I guess a block, you can see how long it lasts. Oh, that was almost too soon or too late. Got it. Okay, not too bad. 30 out of 100, so we're getting there with that level up, that's cool. And I think we're good to keep moving. Dude, this game has a lot of charm to it, it's really fun. Uh, let's, I guess, go for that ceiling if there's nobody else around here, sure. Okay, we're taking you down. Okay, so there's one on the floor and there's one up here. Wish we could attack more than one target at once. I'm sure eventually we'll get something like that. But for right now. Gotcha. Oh, I, I, I tried to see if I couldn't get my timing better. That was not the best idea. V's a little low on health at the moment. We gotta be careful with that. Okay. So up to 42 now. But I'm going to very quickly, uh, See if I can't like get some food. Uh, inventory, no items. Oh, we don't have anything to heal. 
Metals. Yeah, I don't want hard mode. Library. Okay, what is this? Okay, so this is our little discovery page then. A bestiary discoveries, recipe book, records. Oh, that's so cool. So yeah, let's keep up with everything for right now. Just gotta be careful because I can't heal, but what about this guy? Is he an enemy? I don't know. Hmm. I guess we'll just try talking to him. Oh, okay. Excuse me, bug of old complexion. So is everything all right? Hey, Kabu, we're supposed to be adventuring. Snake Mount then, endless riches? Sorry, V, I cannot ignore an old bug in distress. First of all, the name's Chuck, and I'm a bit younger, but and I bet I'm younger than the both of you. But if you've gotta know. I'm almost done arranging my cozy rest space for travelers going to Snake Mount then. I just can't pull out this darn weed. You call this cozy? Chuck, Snake Mount then is more dangerous than rain on a wedding day. Shouldn't you be warning the travelers? Look, will you help me or not? I'm not doing any pulling, at least not for free. Hmm, watch this, V. If I press B near small bushes or rocks. Whoa, nice! Whoa, nice, that's what I said! <laughs> me and V are like very similar, I guess. Something like this is no match for my horn. Oh, V, you actually helped me. This made my week. You've got a reward ready, right? But V, helping others is already its own reward, and you didn't do anything. <laughs> It really, it's really, really not. <laughs> no worries, helpful bugs deserve gratitude. I ain't got much, please take this. You got 10 berries. Berries, so many berries. Use them to buy something nice later, all right? Thank you, we surely will. Be, uh, we'll be going now, make sure to warn others of the danger. If you are near something that can be interacted with with the horn, a exclamation mark will show up um, over the party leader's head. Okay. So if there is anything we can slice and dice, like this right here, we can do that. And we got a honey drop. Honey produced in the bee kingdom makes you happy, but also fat, restores five TP. Okay, cool. So I'll have to look around for that later. Um, for right now, want to know more about the enemies you're fighting? Don't forget you can spy using the strategies menu during battle. Yep, we've been doing that. We can also cut some of this stuff up. It might not have much for us, but it's worth checking. Oh, there's some more berries. Oh, is this one? Oh no, oh can we hit you? Yeah, look at that! Nice, we're getting a good start here. Okay, so you have times two damage I suppose because it's just such a good start. Oh, gotcha. But you're not done, ooh, okay. Oh, but we have times two attacks. Interesting that that's how it's set up. Um. Okay, so yeah, V's not looking so good back there. I'm sort of feeling bad for her. Okay, so V, just go ahead and um, Give that a little toss, and hope they don't go for you. I blocked it, that's good. Uh, let's go for it. And is that enough to take you down? You bet it is. So we're more than halfway there to our next level up. Pretty cool. And they gave us some extra bars, which is nice, but I'm looking for some healing right now. Uh, which button was it? Oh yeah, it was this button, okay. Okay, ooh, what is this? You got a crunchy leaf, a dry leaf, has a satisfying crunch one bit, restores four HP to an ally. Let's go ahead and use that right now. Crunchy leaf, on V, gets you back up to full, very cool. And what about this guy? Lots of weeds to cut through. This is it, Snake Mouth Den. Doesn't look that scary, you know? According to the rumors, I have heard it is the grave of a thousand explorers. Having ended countless journeys, many a song have been written about its dangers. F for real? Its interior must be absolutely riddled with monsters and death traps. We must be extremely cautious. Geez, way to sell it to me, Kabu. But the higher the danger, the more the better the treasure. Hmm. It's true that the artifact is likely to be inside, but are simple riches worth the risk, uh, such a risk to you? Stop trying to scare me off. Let's get in there. I must make sure she stays safe. Ha ha ha, he's so sweet. Okay, so what can we do around here? We can cut that up. What about these? Not really. So it's all these taller ones that we can usually get through. So I will go ahead and go in there in just a moment after I'm sure found everything over here. Looks like I have. Okay, so yeah, oh, we can also save. Oh, just right after I use the item. Oh, we found a crystal berry. You found a crystal berry. These are rare items sought by collectors around the world. Maybe someone will trade them for rare goodies somewhere. Okay, wait, what did that say about the pause menu? Probably that I can see them somewhere. Um, 
metals, uh, library. Hmm, probably. Anyways, we found Sink Mount Den. That's cool. Oh yeah, we can see them on the very bottom right. Okay, cool. So we'll definitely try to get more of those if we see them, but for right now, let's go ahead and hit this. Would you like to save? Yep, and also heals us, so. I wish I didn't use my item I did before. But that's fine, we'll figure it out. Hopefully everything goes well here in Snake Mouth then. But yeah, the cave I guess looked like a, the opening of a snake's mouth. <laughs> There's much more light here. This room must be quite near the cracked ceiling. What a surprisingly cozy entrance. Uh-huh. Hey, Kabu, do you really have to comment on every small thing? Uh, I, I'm sorry. Hey, hey, don't look so sad. How about this? If I want to know more about where we are, or about something, or someone near us, I'll just tap minus, sound good? Very well, I will make sure to have information at hand for when you do. Cool, now let's keep going. That's cute though. Think about then is quite dangerous, but this room is quite, uh, quite cozy. Let's go before you jinx it. <laughs> okay, let's look at these enemies. These guys are like little roly polies. I tried to hit them with the slice, but it didn't quite work. Um, oh, okay, I blocked it. So some of these guys will start with an attack. Good to know. For right now though, we are definitely going to want to spy on you. Okay, and Aniches, <laughs> that's a tongue twister. This spiky bug is still in its larval stage. HP three, defense two, scene one, defeated zero. Until now, although it has impressive armor, it stands no chance against my horn. So let's go ahead and, okay, that does move use up his attack. Oh no, that didn't do any damage. So I guess uh, it's all up to uh, Kabu. Oh, I did the wrong thing too, whoops. Um, oh, but now that his like soft exterior is available, we can get him, or interior. Anyway, 61 points, pretty good. And it looks like that means we're gonna get up this way. It doesn't seem like there's too many, actually. Can we cut this? Nope. Okay, we're good. Whoop. There's another berry for us. <laughs> Could I get across to there? Not as we currently are, but maybe as somebody else. Wee! I like that. And what about this? Some enemies have defense, which reduces the power of your attacks. Sharp horns ignore some defense, and can even flip certain enemies, negating defense entirely. Okay. And what about this way? Huh. Well, actually, yeah, let's read this. Sink Mount then is quite dangerous, but this room is quite close. Okay. Um, thought you were gonna say something else. Here we go. The bridge seems to be out. How are we going to cross? Well, that's it. Game over, let's go back. Wait, V, hold on. It's too soon to give up. There must be a way. Duh, I was kidding, you know. Look over there. It's one of those ancient switches. We just need to hit it. You can just fly over to it, right? That's too much effort. I've got a better plan. <laughs> My mighty beamerang. I just need to get in front of X and press B to throw it. I think he said that again. I will trust you with this then. Give it your best shot. All right then, so. Which button was it? Ah, no, that's not the right button. Okay, it's B. Hey, look at that. So we didn't quite hit the switch, but we, we did that instead. <laughs> well done, V, I wasn't expecting you to do that. Um, yeah, of course, just as planned. Let's continue, I'm glad to have a reliable partner. Super reliable. Okay, well. Happy accident or otherwise, we now have this ability. It cannot cut those, so gotta rely on Kabu for that still. Anyways, go ahead and give that a slice, maybe. Oh no, so I still have to use you with it? Oh, okay, seems to be broken. Interesting, so maybe I'll keep us Kabu! Ah, oh, come on! Yikes. Okay, we blocked that, but they, luckily not both of them get to attack. Uh, for right now, Nice, three points of damage there, um, and I'll go for you as well. Boop. And now you're finished. Blocked it. Not too bad of a deal. Kabu is getting a little low on health right now, though. I'm a little bit worried about that. That knocks you over, and then V can just attack with the boomerang. Boop. Yeah. And that's 74 damage. Pretty cool. Oh, 74 damage, there's 74 experience. You know what I was saying, I just said the wrong word. What is, what does this say? There's a little message over here. Leave this place, for beyond points, at this point lies great danger. We've already lost one of ours to this wretched place. Curses, the co this coziness was an illusion. Our path won't be easy, that, that, that much is for sure. 
No place full of treasure has ever been safe. So many have fallen looking for the for riches. Let's find the treasure quickly so no one else ventures in here. I will do this for them. <laughs> He's so noble. Logbook upgraded. I wanna see what that is then. Um, that would be library. I don't know. Um, Explorer's message. We've already lost one. Okay, so that's pretty cool. Lost to what? How did that happen? The ominous letter left behind for future explorers raises more questions than the answers. But one thing is for sure, it is not a prank. Not meant to be taken lightly. All who read it and proceed have been rightfully warned. I love how you actually do have a little descriptions. A cavern found at the edges of the ant kingdom and the source of the river that cuts through the Bulgaria's outskirts. Many explorers have tried their luck at trying to re retrieve artifacts from the rumored ancient tribe that inhabited this place, but few ever came back. We don't have number two, but I think it was probably that area we couldn't quite jump to. So I don't know if V actually learns to fly in this game. Maybe that'd be too convenient. Um, so can I throw this at you? Oh, oh. Okay, well that didn't do too much. Oh, I tried so hard to time it. It's tough. Okay, so, oh, they got me there too. We're actually in a bit of trouble there. So for right now, might as well get over here to you and knock you over. I don't think you can attack when you're stuck like that at the least, so buys us some time to get rid of this guy. Okay, I blocked it. Oh, you're still gonna attack though. Not good. Cabo's down to three HP. Uh, I want you to attack the other person. Why can you? Okay, well, we'll just do this instead then. Boom. And then Kabu, attack him. Nice. And that got him, okay, cool. Up to 87, so we're almost there. We'll keep working on it. But I really hope we find a source of HP soon, because things are getting to be a bit of a struggle. Ooh, there's a little bouncy area over here. Whoop. What is this? Um, ah! Okay, I could have done something with that. Uh, oh, whoa! Okay. I can just, I can knock this around. Okay, so what's going on in here? We've reached a dead end. But it's ancient ruins, so not really. Right, if we leave no stone unturned, we will open a path. <laughs> Literally, no stone unturned. Aha, so here's another one we can move around. And I'm guessing... Yep, we can put those on the switches. Do the same thing over this way. And as you can see, that opens up this big fancy door. Oh. Uh, a mushroom? What? We did all that this for that? Seriously, it wasn't even a rare item. Heck, if it wasn't a rare, it wasn't even a rare mushroom. Who designed this place? I will sting them in the face. I'll tear the place down. Come now, V. Unfortunate as it may be, let's pick it up and start looking again. Arr. I love her so much. All right, we found a mushroom. A mushroom, beyond average, restores three HP to any ally and cures poison. Uh-oh. I have a feeling that was a trap. Oh no. Huh? What? Oh no! Oh, uh, yeah! Oh, phew, that was close. Oh yeah, that's right, she could fly. Kabu, are you okay? I guess he is, hmm. This is the perfect time to go home. I don't like the look of that place. No, don't leave him behind. But I'm his reliable teammate. I'm going to regret this. Oh no, holy, oh, she's reliable. Can't you just pick him up? Oh, but the door is opening. Whoa. So we gotta find our way back up so we can go inside of there. Oh, he's not looking so good. Uh, no rush, I can wait. <laughs> oh, I am lucky this mushroom broke my fall. I would have carried you, but you seem really heavy. I assure you I'm lighter than I seem, uh-huh. Anyways, this place is really creepy. I must agree, and there doesn't seem to be a way back up for me. We will have to look around. Let's be careful, okay? You are almost a goner. Okay, so let's definitely take a look around and see what we can find. Right now, not much, but... Oh, okay, there's a healing spot over here. Very nice to get that. Once again, that should heal us. Yep, no wait, I wanted to... I, I did indeed want to save. <laughs> I want to make sure that if we do meter demise, we can only start back up here, right? So what can we do around here? Oh my, oh my, oh my indeed. Yikes, is that a moth? By the queen, what a terrible fate. A moment of silence and solidarity for a fallen explorer. 
<laughs> oh no, he's sleeping. Wait, he's alive! Quick, we must free him. Okay, I must be, I must, I, I'm just going to see if the boomerang can get cut through the web. I will make sure there are no others watching. V, watch out! Oh, whoa, nice moves! Oh no, it's a spider! I don't like it. Uh, 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 a spider! How could a bee so huge sneak up on us? Kabul, we've gotta run, treasure ain't worth this. It's not that, we can't abandon this poor moth to his fate. I, I. Oh, get back here, right now. V, V, wait, curses. Oh no, we're on our own. We're on our own, this has to be some cruel irony. However, I can't give up, even if I'm alone. So V wasn't as reliable as we had hoped. That's sort of a shame. All right then, so what items do we have? We have Honey Drop, so neither of these are gonna be too helpful right now. Um, we do have Taunt, but that's not really gonna help us too much. Obviously, they're going to be attacking us. So, let's just go in, to, in for it. Ready? Yeah! That didn't do anything. Uh, okay, I blocked it though, awesome. Okay, maybe we can do this. Yeah! Uh, okay, that one hurt. <laughs> didn't time that very well. It is stronger than it looks. Oh, where are you going? Crud, it's too high up, if only V was here. Must I really sit here and do nothing? Well, um, strategies. I can't spy on you? I guess I can sit here and do nothing. I have the character to do nothing until next round. Oh, wait, I for forgot what button to press. Oh, now we're poisoned? What's happening? It it's too much by myself after all. Ah! No, Kabu! Everyone, I, I failed. You wasted your hopes on me. Whoa, oh, uh-oh, she's back, maybe. Oh, okay. V, look, I, by the holy jaws of the queen, V, you left me to my fate, you are vile. Hey, I was going to apologize and I came back, right? You pushed me away from the web, but I still left, so I'm. I will properly scold you later. The situation is dire, but I've got a plan. We will attack the web holding the moth while battling the spider. And we bail when we free him? Precisely, except we'll run together, this time without leaving anyone behind. I apologized already. Here it comes, let's do this. All right, we'll do what we can. Uh, So we gotta attack the web instead of, yeah, okay. Nice. And same thing for you. Ooh, not bad. Oh. Okay, I got the right button. So we didn't get poisoned because of that, nice. Ready? That's not too bad. Once again. Okay. Oh, he's falling. Oh, nice. All right, we did it. Is he still snoozing though? Be gone, wretched beast. Oh, he didn't like that. Kabu, I'm done here. Well done. Let's get out of here. Run! Oh my. Ah! It's still chasing us right now. Leave us alone already, monster. Ooh! Ooh, didn't like that, did ya? Oh. Oh. Gee, glad it's too fat to come in here. Um, Kabu, sorry for running away. <sighs> Very well. You are forgiven, V. It was understandable. Took you long enough. Most people would be crying at getting rescued. <laughs> Let's turn over a new leaf, V. This moth is our priority. You're awake. <laughs> Are they tired? Are they speaking a different language? What the? Hey, you okay? You hit your head? Could this moth be speaking in an ancient tongue? Perhaps he is one of the fabled tribes lurking underground. No. We can speak Bugnish. Do you need, like, a minute? No. We are fine now. Thank goodness, you had us quite worried. Where are we? Where's the spider? Right, let's get you up to speed. So I guess we're getting up to speed now. <laughs> I like how it's just, ba -ba 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 -ba. Truly, it seems we owe our life to you, V. Seriously? No big deal. It stinks we were that we were trapped, though. Uh, were you looking for treasure as well, alongside fellow explorers, or what's your name? Leaf is fine, and somewhat, a scouting mission, in fact. You've got some luck to be alive. Did you learn anything scouting? About the artifact? 
Artifact, if it is here, it's probably ahead. If we work together, we will surely find both it and the exit. We have little choice. We will accompany you. Interesting that he talks poorly about himself. Can you fight? Not really part of scouting. Seriously, you came into this place without knowing how to fight? Make sure to stay behind us so we can protect you. How reassuring. Okay, we've spent too much time here. Let's look for the exit. That's cool, we got ourselves a little party here. So, um, can we switch to him? I guess not. <laughs> Be interesting if he had his own little ability. I would do it to save, yes. Saving, please stand by. Okay, so we'll keep going for a little bit longer. I do wanna still sort of enjoy the game for a bit because, you know, this game seems to have a lot to it, so I feel like I wanted to give it about an hour. Um, but what a weird tablet. It's written in even, an even weird language. It seems to be an ancient script. Hmm, these letters look familiar to us. We should be able to decipher it. Let's check out it again. You can switch your party order during battle using the strategy flower. Whoever is in front receives a bonus to attacking power. In return, said person is targeted more often by enemies. You, can, you can't switch if someone has exhausted all their turns. Hmm. Okay, oh, here's an enemy. Gotcha! Nice. So we get, um, I think, two starting attacks. But first, we are going to use one of those attacks, identifying you. So let's spy on you. Oh, darn. Okay, well, I guess both of our attacks identifying you. That is so tough. I don't know why that's so tough for me. There we go. Eep, that ant is possessed. No way, it's a zombie ant. Weird. That's just a st the story the queen tells kids to scare them. This is too creepy. I'm gonna take it out. Huh? Ah! Oh, I don't like it. Okay, so we don't need to spawn you anymore, so let's just go ahead and. There we go. Three damage. I forget. Oh, yeah, so I had. So we should be able to take it out with us if we just time it correctly. Maybe. Oh, wait. Uh, okay, didn't block that one either. It's fine. Gotcha. Okay, well good enough. As you can see, we took it out. We're up to 95, so we're about to get a level up. Get to experience what that is like. Did it drop anything? Yep, dropped another berry. So there's a couple of ways to go. Oh no, he fell! Okay, he's fine, he's fine. <laughs> but I wanna go this way first, because, oh, oh, I didn't get to attack you this time. That's fine. Right now, let's go for you. Three damage done. And there we go. There we go, that was a good block. And then we can just finish you off real quick. Because if this is not the way we're supposed to go, it's sort of the way I want to go. Um, so we can see what's going on over here. But we get ourselves a level up. Rank up. Cool. Oh, so we get to choose. Pick a stat boost for the new rank. Uh, team gets plus one health point for each member, letting you survive longer. Team gets plus three teamwork points, letting you use more skills. Or team gets plus three metal points, letting you equip more metals. I think we'll keep with health right now. But there we go. So we did get our, our health refilled there for uh, surviving that. And V learned secret slash, apparently. You found a honey drop. Okay, we know about honey drops. They restore team points. Uh, ah, I still can't time that. <laughs> I've been trying. And that was not good either. Do they both get to attack? They don't, okay, good. So that'll knock you over, and now you can either do that, or we can try, you have secret stash, not secret slash. So there's tornado toss, tosses the boomerang in a circular motion, multi-hit move that targets a single enemy. And there's also Vi heals four HP to an ally while curing poison and item from her secret stash. This does not consume normal items. So we got some cool stuff there. Um, for right now, we're just gonna have you throw this. And that time I blocked it. So let's keep it going. Gotcha. Oh, that was super. <laughs> okay. And that was great. Okay, so how many points do we need now? We need 101. <laughs> okay, not too much more, luckily. Uh, I'm sure it'll jump up more as we keep going. Uh, but what is this gonna have for us? That is going to have another mushroom. So more HP, healing poison, pretty cool stuff. And we're getting higher and higher with berries. Oh, here we go, here's another one of these crystal berries. Cool. Uh, pressing B in battle allows you to charge who is, change who is currently, uh, uh, currently acting without changing the party order. Uh, each party member has different ways of attacking and different and different reaches for their attacks and skills. Mind who's currently acting not to not waste actions on the wrong enemy. 
I agree. I think we've already done that a little bit before, so good to keep in mind. But now we gotta go the other way. But that was cool because that got us one of those secret collectibles. And we're just gonna go over here now. And uh, let's do that. <laughs> so we're gonna keep this going. And let's also see what's going on over this way. Ah, oh, couldn't quite get him. I keep trying though. So first let's block that, but then let's also see what we can do here. So, um, there's Taunt. Yeah, that's all we have for him. So nothing too crazy. Hopefully he unlocks a new ability at the next level up. There we go. And should I try one? Of, I don't think we should try one of the special abilities. I think we'll be fine with just this. Yep, we got him. Up to 15 points. So let's clear out whatever else is on this island. There's another one of those little switches over there. So maybe we can throw the boomerang at that one. Oh, I missed a berry on the floor. There we go. What does this say? Hitting an enemy outside of the battle will stun it for a short amount of time. Entering battle while an enemy is stunned grants one more action to the party leader. Yep, and we saw that. So can I hit this? I have to get it at just the right angle. It's a little tricky. Weird. Uh. Seems like no matter which way I try to hit it. There we go. And there we go. So now we can actually go that way. Cool. Switching back to Kabu for now. Oh, there's another zombie ant. Oh, I tried to get you. The, the angling can be a little bit weird with that. I'll have to get used to it. For right now though, yeah, that's sort of the, the one weakness with Kabu is that he can't, hmm. yeah, he can't, um, attack anybody except for who's ever in the front. So I think we'll try one of these. Let's try Tornado Toss on you. Oh, that was cool. It was like a little timing thing. Ooh, unbelievable. That is too adorable. All right, well, unfortunately it was not enough to get rid of the zombie yet. So I don't know if it was truly worth it, but there we go. And there's something. So we need to switch again. Switch to Kabu and that knocked you over. And then V, if you don't mind. Let's go with something like that. That did three damage, pretty good. She's starting to become more of the damage dealer. 24 out of 101, we're getting there. And they dropped some more berries. And what is, oh, what is that? Can she pick items up with her boomerang? Oh, you got an HP plus medal. Increases your allies HP by two. So that's really helpful. So we got our medals and stats here. Um, this will use up two of our points, but that's fine. Oh, but it, okay, so I could give this to, okay. I wanna give the V, because she has less health. That's very interesting. Good to know, though. I could have probably gotten that one mushroom way back when then, if I had used that ability. If I had, like, really went back that way. If I could have, I don't know. Uh, oh, what is this guy? Nice work, every, one. Leave, watch out! Oh! I thought you couldn't attack. What the heck? By the great ancestors, what kind of sorcery is that? We uh, are unsure, this is new. You seriously expect us to believe that? We mean it, it's the truth. Magic's no common feat. There are less than 10 known sorcerers in history. You're not some, some criminal with a huge bounty, are you? You seriously believe that? Oh my, we will talk later. I take it you can fight now? We'll try. All right, I like these guys, they're cool. Now wait, everyone. Now that we're a trio, let me share a useful technique. With that turn relay picked from the colorful flower, one of us can lend our turn to another. How is that useful? It sounds tedious. Well, for example, we can let V attack twice, knock down, an, knock down flying enemies. <laughs> you should let me attack three times, I'll take the ball on. You shouldn't abuse it like that, though. The exhaustion will reduce the attack power by one every time you act in the round. Urgh, fine. Well, it sounds like it sounds mildly useful. We'll try it out. Now on your guard. So, let's for right now attack and throw this over like that. So now he's on the floor. So we could turn and relay this um, to knock a two V and have you attack like that. There we go. And that's enough to knock them down. So I do want to try, um, you know, Leaf against the Jelly Shrimp, but we actually have never uh, identified these people, so let's spy them. There we go, first try. Huh, mushrooms get crazier by the day. Jelly Shroom, HP six, scene two. 
Although some of our skills are could finish it off quickly, Vi, help save help, help save us some TP. Okay, we blocked that. We're gonna attack again. We blocked it. So for right now, we are going to attack you again because why not? Boom. And we can get you over this way. So we might not actually be able to have the chance to attack his leaf here. Oh no, we will. Um. So yeah, we'll just. That's like a weird timing thing, but I like it. Alrighty then, so as you can see, 32 points, but that's sort of more of like a ground attack. So we wouldn't have been able to reach a jelly with that. Goodness, that magic isn't a joke. It's pretty cool. If you try, <laughs> that was a pun. <laughs> if you truly couldn't do it before, this den is hiding more secrets than I first thought. Everything is just too suspicious. I don't believe Leaf yet. We're telling the truth. If we had ice magic, that accused spider wouldn't have caught us. I say, let's focus on getting out alive. We can collect our thoughts when we're safe. Very well. If you need us to freeze anything, press B while we are leaving. I guess it's fine for now. Onward! I can almost smell the treasure. Anyways, we'll go ahead and do that. And we'll keep looking around a little bit, but that might be where we wrap it up for today. We might go a little bit farther. Um, there we go. Oh, that got us another uh, crunchy leaf. Frozen enemies can't be stunned, but can be climbed on or used to hold switches. Interesting. So I have to keep that in mind. What is this about? Ah, oh no, eep! It's not funny, I'm all soaked now. So sorry, V, I couldn't help it. <laughs> Seems like the ceiling's dripping. Ugh, why is there so much water in here? Under us, above us, doesn't make sense. Hmm, this is good though. What do you mean? If it is, if it's water. Oh, look at that, then it can be frozen. Impressive, if you can do that, then it opens up a lot of options for us. I bet I can push them with my horn as well. That's pretty cool, Leaf. Mm -hmm. Enemies, the water around us, even though they seem like obstacles, we can exploit them for our own benefit. Let's give your ice magic a try on on all we can find. I like this character, they're really cool. Um, the craftsmanship on this statue is pretty good compared to everything else at least. That is, it's a shame the monument outlived its creators. Yeah, you can only hear about roaches in folktales nowadays. Pardon? Where did the roaches disappear? A bit before I was born, I think. So pretty recently, hey! <laughs> it was quite a, it was indeed quite the recent event. No one knows for sure the how or why, however. This is, that, this is depressing talk. We should really find a way out. This can't be right. So who knows how long he's been sleeping for? An old statue. So we can't read that one for whatever reason? Oh, I tried to get him, didn't quite work. And I couldn't block it either, yikes. So let's try this out. First off, um, we need Kabu to knock you over. We will have, you can attack either of them. Seeing how his, his back is to the ground, it might be better to do this one. Three damage too, so that's nice. Um, and then V, if you would like to uh, go for this, that'll knock out this guy. And now you're gonna attack, and I blocked it. And we should just be able to go for one more here and that might take you out. I think so. Well, there we go. It's at the 40 points. And a good couple of berries. What's going on in here? There's something. Oh, that's a nice chunk. Okay, so, uh, hmm. There's some more water being pushed around here. Oh, okay, so now I see what's going on here. Um, we'll check all that out momentarily. I just wanted to see if there's anything extra back this way. Doesn't look like it. So we can switch over to uh, Leaf here and they can uh, do that. Oh no, hold on, hold on. And that was a honey drop. Oh no, I fell. <laughs> okay, that's fine. And then I guess with all that, we could just get up this way, no problem. That was actually a lot of fun. So yeah, we've done a lot of exploring in today's episode. It seems like there's, of course, plenty more you can do in this game. It's an RPG. These games usually go on for pretty long. But that was a really fun first taste of Bug Fables. And this is why I'm really excited for the series because you never know what kind of cool gems we could stumble upon that I probably wouldn't have had the time to play otherwise. But as always, I would love to hear if you'd like to see, hear me or to see me turn this into a full series. I'd love to hear about that. But uh, for right now, stay tuned for a new game next episode. But for right now, that's gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Zebra's Arcade. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.